you waiting for now? It's just that you know what they say about the bottomless grotto. That it's so deep that once you fall in, you never get back out. And that's exactly why we're going in. Mm-hmm. Listen to me carefully. Flo will be going into that grotto to look for the magic drop. And that will be our chance to steal the friendship's heart from her. If we lose this chance again, I guarantee you prefer the bottomless grotto to having me on your back forever. Is that clear? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now stop wasting your time and let's go. I'll fix a trap that she won't ever forget. Well, we're here. The most important thing once we're inside is to stay together. No one goes off alone, understand? Well, I won't, that's for sure. Don't worry. I'm with you all the way. Boys, we're almost there. It's all the same in here. Rocks, rocks, and more rocks. Well, here we are. What do you boys think? Nice place, huh? But it's a rocky mo- It looks like a rock to you two because you're just two ignorant numbskulls. But I'm certain that Flo would like it as much as she won't be able to resist getting a little closer to look at this wonder of nature. They say that whoever falls in that pit has no hope. I've ever seen light again. Huh? <laughs> hey, uh, what are you doing, <laughs> Ema? Why should I explain anything? You never understand anyway. Always the gentle one she is. One thing's for sure, our friends are in for a big surprise. Well, it sure is dark in here. Yeah, it's a good thing we have our Let's flashlights. Let's keep our eyes open. The magic drop could be anywhere. And please, everyone stay together. I have to be careful. I don't want anything to happen to my little mistress. I've never been in a grotto before. It's beautiful. It looks like we have very different tastes. Wow, it really is amazing. What is it, little mistress? It's a stalactite. I've only seen them in school books. It's quite different up close and personal. You must be careful where you put your paws because uh, it's dangerous! Oh, magic! Oh, magic, watch ah! out! Stop right there! They're slippery, and they seem to have a strange odor. Congratulations on your sense of smell, William. Ema. You're behind this. We should have known all along it was you. Don't your friends know they have to be very careful where they put their paws, especially if someone puts down some very slippery grass. Come on out. Show yourselves. I'll find you anyway. No, Chiro. Let her be. First, we have to worry about saving flow and magic. That's our first priority. You're absolutely right. I'm sorry. Ah! <laughs> Little mistress, are you all right? I'm absolutely okay. Fortunately, the water broke our fall. Wow. Well, now we know. The bottomless grotto has a bottom. It's also incredible. It's truly amazing. Wow, it's so beautiful. But I'm afraid we're lost. The royal guards will be worried sick about us. We've got to find a way to get out. I'm sorry, little mistress. It's all my fault. If I hadn't slipped, we wouldn't be in this predicament. Well, at least we're together, and I'm sure that we'll find a way out of here. Our friends won't abandon us. Well, then let's get busy. This way. No, that way. Or at least I think so. These tunnels are like a maze. Don't worry, little mistress. I said we'd get out of here, and we will get out of here. Mm. And now where are we, Magic? 
I have no idea. I thought that with my sense of smell, I'd have found a way out. But down here, everything smells the same. Are you cold? No, not really. My little mistress is very cold. She just doesn't want me to worry. Uh, even in these difficult moments, it's wonderful to be together. That goes for me too, Magic. I can even hear the friendship song playing in my head. Yeah, me too. Oh, but it's not our imagination. Someone is really singing the friendship song. It's coming from up there. Turned on the lights. We did. Who are you? Who are we? Who are you? Hey, but you're a little girl. Hello, everyone. My name is Flo. Flo? The Flo? The extraordinary singer of the friendship song? Well, yes. It's quite an honor, and I must say, a privilege to meet you. You're our favorite singer. Well, thanks. That's nice of you to say. My little mistress and I are lost. Could you be so kind as to help us to find a way out? Why, of course. Follow us, won't you? You'll find another grotto that will lead you out. We have to stop here. The light is rather bothersome to us, you know. Thanks for everything. No, no, thank you. And if you ever want to have a sing-along, you know where to find us. Bye-bye. Out up there! Run! Come on! Magic! Look! Up ahead! The magic drop! Stay right where you are! Ooh. For the umpteenth time, I remind you that you have something which belongs to me. You'd better hand over the friendship's heart if you know what's good for you. Is that clear? You can forget it. Correct answer, Flo. How did you guards find us? We're also good at tailing others. Grab the princely collar from Flo. Hurry! If I can't have a Frenchie's heart, then I'll steal the magic drop. I'm sorry, but you're a little too slow, Ema. Oh, all right. You win again this time, but I warn you. Sooner or later, your luck will run out, and I will try it. It's all your fault, as <laughs> usual. <laughs> it's good to see you both again, and I'm glad to see you're safe and sound. Thanks, but not nearly as good as seeing you, friends. Come on, let's get back to Pocketville. There's a puppy waiting to be born. Right, and I'm really curious about what they'll give Amy as a present. Well, what do you think? Huh? Mm, so what you're saying is that you want to give the princess a leaf? <laughs> What's so funny, Christmas Rooster? <laughs> Look at what's on top of the leaf, Chiro. It's a new princely collar for Amy. For now, it's just a prototype. It'll take some time to make it, but it'll be ready the next time Flo comes to Pocketville. I know that Amy will love it. It's a splendid collar. So are you ready to be born? Are you kidding? I'm beside myself. I'm so happy. Actually, these are mine. Hmm? 
A little check? Hey, you're tickling me! One for me? Thank you. You know, you and your little chick are really nice. Really? No one's ever told me that before. Thank you. Why, of course. I get it. I understand huh? now why we're not able to get the princess back. We have to finish the puzzle first. <laughs> Look, it's only missing just one piece. And finally, we can embrace our princess. 